Alrighty, folks, back again with another Doom. We lost a rock, paper, scissors once again. And no, we've opened up the greatest card of all time, but we did open up decent, I say. It's not the greatest. Why do we keep drawing Doom King, man? Oh, that is another thing he told me to add, too. Um, I, I, don't, I still don't remember if I continue my train of thought. I think I just literally stopped talking halfway through. But yeah, my guy Billy Williams, he he suggested I play, like I said, Executor with Vendreds and stuff like that, like with Rivalry. And like Zion Bordeaux, so our players basically won't be able to Twin Twister. They won't be able to, oh, this is new Malefic shit. Um, they won't be able to Twin Twister. They won't be able to uh, target us with, uh, he can only target Executor. I mean, our opponent can only target Executor. But um, we'll be able to most likely get Core equipped on Executor. So we couldn't target anything on the field. So we beat Sky Strikers. Um, I don't know about all two guys because, I, don't, I mean, no, yeah. so, Soliloquy tar Soliloquist target. Um... Uh, and yeah, all that. So I know we'll probably have a very good matchup against that deck, but yeah, we're gonna start with this. And what's great about starting with this, if he doesn't have a fucking Ash or something, um, what's great about starting with this, folks, and I know what you're wondering, well, why would you do that during start phase? Doom King only requires a field spell. It only requires a field spell. Doom King is, uh, we, even though we keep drawing Doom King, I don't think we're gonna be able to get a match with this person, but. Um, we'll see here. So, what we'll do? Oh, we can't go Phoenix. That is a that is a bummer. But we can go into the best fucking card in the game, which is this. And I do want to go into that. So let's try that out. Um, I don't think we're gonna use Doom King. I don't think we need to use Doom King. Hopefully, this man doesn't have anything for us, and it doesn't look like he do. So, this we're gonna start with this. Um, we're gonna target Doom King. We're gonna increase the level. What the hell does this do? Huh? Bonus card that you can activate it. If you do, neither player can target cards and fill zones with card effects me while that card is faced up. Wait, what? Okay. The effect of becomes negated. In the oh, okay. So you know what? We're going to activate this for free because I don't know what the fuck he has and I haven't checked out the new... Um, you know what? I lost my train of thought again. I haven't checked out the new Malefic support so I don't know if they have a counter trap or anything. I think they kind of do. Um, but these penalty games are going to be kind of shitty. I don't know why. We keep drawing everything that we don't want, like, technically in our hand, multiples of, or even one of. We don't want in our hand, and we just keep drawing it. We're definitely going to get rid of Cyberin, because Cyberin is just way more fancy than the other guy. So we're going to summon Mizuki. Then we're going to go Gozuki. And then with this, we're going to just send probably Smith? Do I want to send Smith or Banshee? I think I want to send uh, Goblin Zombie. I think that's what the fuck I want to send here. Um, so what we can do with this, we can do something fun. What we can do is we can actually go, we can use these two to go Samurai. And I think, I mean, not Samurai, but we can use these two to go into this sucker first. And then we, you know what, we probably should have got Smith. Probably should have definitely got, actually we definitely should have got Smith for this situation here. Um, like I said, I don't know their support, so I don't know if he's going to have anything sitting down there, but we're probably going to draw a card. Ooh, go Sarcophagus. Never mind. We're actually 100% fine. Um, so what we can actually do is banish Sunset, and I think that's what we're going to do here. We're going to banish Sunset. We're going to go Saga. Um, wait, what? Let me see. All right, so what we're going to do is uh actually what what are we going to get to our hand here i actually don't know what to get because i'm a gold sark for shogun saga now i'm a gold sark sunset and then special lit with shiri nui guy so i guess we just get Ban banshee yeah we'll get banshee because i like banshee all right so what we're going to do is activate gold sark i don't know what his back row is and then since we can't really we can't really fuck him up on, uh, we can't use this effect on our turn. We're going to have to, uh, what's the name? So we're going to banish Sunset. Then we're going to use this. And then if we use, yeah, banish Fire Monster, it destroys a Spell or Trap. And then we also can destroy a monster. So we're going to banish Solitaire. So everybody's going to gain 300. And then we're also going to destroy a Spell and Trap. So you can't chain to it. It's, it can, it's just, the whole thing is, can we kill this? Which I think we can. Because we can go Shogun Saga, so we can kill this. I'm going to pop this. Um, oh, yeah. Solitaire triggers. We're going to get our young Sunset back. 
then like I said, uh, we can tribute this to get those two back and then we can use Mizuki and what's the name? Yeah, so we're gonna use these two to get Solitaire and Mizuki back. I'm gonna put Mizuki over there. We're gonna put Solitaire over there. We're gonna use those two to go into, we can go to another sucker. We can't go into another sucker, folks. That's what we can do. We can't go into another sucker or we can, wait, let me see. Neither player can target cards in a field zone. So what I think I wanna do here is I can use one and two to go into what's the name and then Mizuki back a uh, Unizombie, target something, discard Banshee and then go from there. I think that's what I kind of want to do here. Matter of fact, we might as well just go double sucker, but that'd be kind of stupid um, because we can only spell some of this once per turn. All right, all right I got to hurry up and think. Uh, yeah, let's go Splendid Saga so we won't. No, 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 we're not going to go Splendid Saga here. Um, fuck, think. Man, we need another. Why did I do that? Why the fuck did I do that? Never mind. I, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm not, I'm not gonna trip. I'm not. I don't. I don't know why I did that, but it's 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 fucking fine, folks. It's fine. All right. It's fine. So we can just target this, discard that, and then we can use this. Activate the zombie world from our deck, and then um, we can go Shogun Saga. We can go Sun Saga. Um, and put what's the name back to the deck and um, yeah we put that and then yeah, we can destroy our opponent's cards this doesn't we just pop this and I think it kills this right but I'm a fucking idiot y'all seen that whole shit happen and y'all didn't say nothing <laughs> oh wait we can still so charge but we can't kill them so it doesn't really matter <laughs> I'm a fucking idiot I knew what I was doing too I knew exactly what the fuck I was doing so it's it's fine it's 100% fine, folks. Uh, it's 100% fine because I knew what I was doing. So, and I actually should have went to what's name. Uh, I knew what I was doing because I knew like this shit. Uh, once I once I did that play, oh, we do monster. Right? This game's over. Um, all right, so it doesn't look like we're going to be finishing. Yeah, he's probably going to just quit. Um, we're definitely going to throw in some twin twisters. We're going to take out Pit of the game because we're going first. Uh, we're going to replace those with uh, it's only two. So the trap tricks comes right back out, and then. Uh, do we just kaiju? No, I think we just evenly match this man and just win from there. So I think that's what we're just gonna do. But yeah, man, I I, I knew that as soon as I did it. You see, we you heard me. Excuse me, but you heard me pause. And that's when I realized. All right, well, yeah, I knew we were. Oh shit, I knew we weren't. Really? All right. Yeah, like I said, I, when I paused, you guys pretty much knew. With it. it went right through my mind. They need a field spell. Not, I mean, any field spell, technically. All right, so this hand is decent. We can start off with Fuller, so we're going to bait out any hand traps. It doesn't look like he has any hand traps, folks. We've drawn Juchel again for some odd fucking reason, but that's fine. That's fine. We'll work around it. So with this, I think we just send Spiritualist here. Yeah, I think we just send Spiritualist, and then, yeah, we, we'll be able to uh, pretty much um, go from there. Um, Unizombie, Sengozuki. And then we can just get the Drushel out of our hands right now. So yeah, that's fine. So I think what we want to do is kind of bump up uh, well, the card that's in my graveyard currently. I think we kind of do want to bump that card up because her, like I said, the starting play with her and Mizuki is pretty good. If we summon her into a Mizuki, we can just uh, immediately get all those cards out. And you know, we can, we can do some stuff there. Um, wow. We're just really drawing all the fucking cards we want, huh? Um, all right, so I think here is, do we go Savage Dragon? I think we kind of do, depending on what we draw. Hopefully we can draw Trap Tricks and then we can just... Oh my God, this game is so good. I love this game, man. I really do. So we're gonna send another Mizuki. And then here, we can just go into the Summon Sorceress. Um, no need to do that. Sadly, we've drawn a uh, what's the name, so that's that's gonna kind of suck, but it's okay. Uh, we'll do this, and then we can target this, and then search. Hmm, we can actually just get out what's the name. I think that might just be a lot better. Yeah, I think that might just be a lot better to do. I don't know if I want to go Savage Dragon though. I think no, actually I do want to go Savage Dragon. 
I don't know what I'm thinking. I definitely want to go Savage Dragon. And we can actually search story time, but we won't have a we won't have what's the name though. But we can though if we get this. So if I get this, I'm able to go Savage Dragon and get Exambu World on the field, and I think that's just I think that's just too good to pass up, man. It's just way too good to fucking pass up. And then we're just gonna get rid of this bloom. Because yeah, we don't we don't play multiple Drew Shells, and for some odd reason, they, you know this game loves to just give me cards I don't want in my hand. So we're gonna get Savage Dragon. Savage Dragon is then gonna get me uh, what's the name? I guess we can just chain this. Just get it out of the way. Um, we're gonna get the Zombie World, and then like I said, we can just get the Sucker, put that over there, and then now we have the Trap Trick. So this game is just effectively over. Effectively close. Um, and then standby phase, we're able to bring that back out. Um, we're actually just going to put him right there. Sadly, I don't know why I did that because if we're playing Western, hopefully, oh, oh, wait, time out. Oh, it's Necro Valley. Okay. So, hmm. I think I want to negate that. No, no, I'm not going to negate that. I'm not going to negate that because. I don't think really any of that matters. So he's gonna grab that. Matter of fact, no. This is this is when you just wait. Necro Valley is fine. Cause I mean, what does it matter? I could just banish anything. Okay. Uh sure. Sure. Um yeah, none of this really matters. Like, right now, we could have easily went West Lane, but in phase, we could just trap tricks and then bring out Swallow Slash and pop his whole. Like, just. Holy fuck. That's pretty good. Well, I mean, he must have. Whoa, whoa, wait. What do you mean? Oh, okay. Is that what you mean? You're just not gonna. You're just not gonna. You're just not gonna fucking see that? Okay. We're just not gonna worry about that, huh? And then, yeah. And it, what the fuck? Why, why am I not able to do that? Response? Um, why well, real warlords? Okay, everything is zombies. Why can't I do this? What's going on here? Why can't I use Swallow Slash? Am I tripping? What's going? Why can't I use Swallow Slash? Is something is something going on that's wrong, bro? Am I am I tripping? Yo, what the fuck? What's going on? Why is Zamburo not effective? Yo, what what's the deal? Oh. When the fuck did they put that shit in here? <laughs> Yo! When the fuck did they put that card in this goddamn game? What is going on? When did Yo! Are you serious? Why did that Oh my god. Oh my god. Why did nobody tell me that? Yo, I, I was this whole fucking time. I was wondering why is this game cheating me? I seriously sat here and thought, why is this fucking game cheating me? And they ratted the card to add that part for what? Why would they add that? Wait, what the fuck the types and attributes have to do with this? Hold on, time out, man. Cause I'm not, whoa. When did that become a thing? I'm beyond, bro, I'm beyond fucking pissed off right now. Why did that become a thing? <laughs> Yo, they really want, they really was trying to push neck. They was trying to push Gravekeepers, this goddamn card. With that errata? Are you serious? With that errata, are you kidding me? Um... I think we just do that, huh? Yeah, I think we just do this, huh? Yeah, we'll just... Yo! That shit is the wildest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. We'll pop that. 
Um, do we just kill his recruiter? No, we don't kill recruiter. Uh, no, he already. Mm, do we just kill recruiter? I don't think they have a swallow slash. I really want to get rid of Necro Valley though, so I'm not tripping. Um, and then, yeah, we'll just do this. That'll work. And then that'll work. But yeah, okay. He's probably not going to play a game two. Oh, he is going to play a game two. Okay, oh, alright. So, let's put that down there. Um, twin twisters immediately go in. We'll take that out. Uh, we'll take the penalty games out because we're going first. Um, and then we'll just put some struggling battles in. And then, I guess, I guess, man, we'll take out Soul Charge and definitely take out Call by the Grave. Um, did we just put in Kaijus instead? I guess. I mean, alright, so that's, I think this is just not gonna leave itself. Okay, so we're just gonna have to leave two solitaires over there. My god, when the fuck did they do that? Why did nobody tell me anything? And this hand is just epitome of why didn't y'all tell me anything? Oh, you're getting ash, sir. But yeah, uh, once again, I think I lost my train of thought. But yeah, we're definitely uh, gonna test this out in the deck because, I mean, when we play in a stun deck, we technically don't need, I mean, we just played three seven sorcerers for the sake of sin. The only thing you really need is uh, sucker. Do you have another word? Oh, you don't even have a word of tribute. This game is over. Oh my god, I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry, man. I got a twin twister, your shit, bro. I got a twin twister, you, my man. I can't play with you like that, my man. I can't play with you like that. All right, there we go. Um, what the fuck does this do? Oh, thank God. Thank God, man. But you can't use it though. Thank God. All right. Um, so we put that. Hmm. Did we just kill him? I think we just kill him, right? Yeah, did we just kill him? I think we just kill him. I think we just kill him here. Um, yeah, I think we just, we just 100% kill him. Um, yeah. We're just, uh, I'm just definitely gonna put game up on board. Why is that? Bro, well, come on, bro. Like, come on, I'm not even holding A no more. Not even holding A. Stop asking me if I want to do something, man. Um... Oh, fuck. Wait a minute. I don't think we can kill him. See, so we can send Mizuki. And then I could Mizuki that back. And then I can normal summon Mizuki to get out of Goblin Sun. Ah, that doesn't kill him. This special summons a certain... I don't know why I'm at. I know exactly what that shit does. Um, do we just bring out... Like, do we just send Banshee here? And then go... What's the name? That's, is that what we do here? Do we just send Banshee? Yeah, I think that's what we do here. And we'll send Banshee. We'll use this to target that. Um, I'm trying to at least kill this man. <laughs> um, no, we don't do that first. We definitely want to draw a card. But, um... Uh, yeah, so we're going to do this. Zuki to bring back uh, Uni. Doesn't really matter. We're not going to really keep it on the board. Hopefully we don't draw into the bloom or something. There's another Twin Twister. That's cool. Um, and then here we just go summon Sorceress. Nope. And then we go this. And then this special summons uh, Spectral Sword or Sunset? I think Sunset. Special summon Sunset. And then we target this to get our Bloom. Um, or we can actually we can actually get out Goblin Zombie. If we could synchro into the Shogun Saga, no, that's just stupid. That's just I'm just doing dumb shit now. Um, no, not to our opponent's side of the field, to our side of the field. And then what we do here, activate Banshee, get the Zombie World on the field. And then here, hmm, we have a lot of choices actually. I definitely 100% want to kill this Necro Valley. So. What I can do here is go Sucker to get the what's name out, and then I can go Spirit Saga. Is there another way I can do this? There's no way I can, uh, yeah, there's no way I can, um, what's the name? So we're going to do this. I don't think we're going to be able to kill him, though. Actually, I think we do. Yeah, we special summon the monster instead, and we link these two to... Could go Necro Dragon, but no. Let's go Spirit Saga. 
use Spirit Saga's effect, and then chain Doom King's effect. Um, banish a monster from the field or graveyard. We'll banish his face down, which is Spy, and then here we'll banish Spiritualist. Um, gain 300 and destroy a spell and trap on the field, which is that. Spiritualist triggers, and I think that was what? That was 600 off. We were 600 off, folks, but we, we, we did get the victory. All right, folks, that is it for today. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Um, yeah, man, I mean, it's pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool. Uh, yeah. Um, yeah, what else to say about this? Uh, yeah, man, it was just, I think we put the, I think we might bump this up, though. I think this might become two or three. Um, I think this might become two or three, so, uh, yeah, I think that, I think, I think this might just go up. I really don't know what to cut though. I mean, yeah, we technically cut the penalty game, but that's my little niche tech. It did, it did provide, it did provide some backup. It did save me from the, uh, it did save me from fucking uh, getting beat by the, uh, the Wesley Ames, uh, whatever it, that spiral deck, whatever the hell it was. We did save us from there, so that's good. But like I said, um, it's already at 43. I really don't want to make it 45 because then, like I said, I can open up hands just like that. And then, um, you know, that is what it is. But, uh, yeah, but I think the monster line is actually solid with 22. But like I said, we probably might bump this up. I just want to keep this in for the Swallow Slash. And then, um, like I said, the Trap Tricks is just so fun. Um, you definitely want to draw into these more than you want to draw into these. Because, you know, this is just, like I said, if they twin twist to you, you can just activate this. And now it just leaves them uh, pretty much bent out of shape. But uh, yeah, I think I think that's all co cool. Um, Story Saga, I really do like it. it does prevent prevent your zombie? I mean, it prevents anything else besides zombies. So that may cause a problem. Um, the Gold Sarks. Now this card is definitely what I might cut. I might cut the Gold Sarks. Um, they're cool, but it really doesn't get anything started in the deck. So those this definitely might get cut. But I don't know what I might replace it for. I might just cut those out and bump up this to two, and then it'll just be at 42. I think we'll try that out because Ghost Art wasn't do, did not do a damn thing. I mean, like I said, it, it, it doesn't out unbreak our hands. This most likely unbreaks our hand um, because then we can get Sunset out, and then like I said, we can just do other plays. And if we have Mizuki, we, we can just go super far with it, and we can uh, actually protect our life points and shit like that. And then, like I said, we get a free draw. Um, actually, do we get? Did we, we don't get two draws, do we? No. Oh no, we we, we kind of do. We do. And then uh, the re oh yeah, and then somebody suggested Don Draxter, but when we use the effect of Spiritualist or Sunset, we're not able to do that. So the Spiritualist, uh, basically Spiritualist Mizuki play where we normal summon this, get this out, go into the seven, use the seven and banish this to draw and discard, and then use Sunset's effect to bring back Mizuki in this to link into uh what's the name sucker and then mizuki back to sunset and then we still have a four and a three on the board and then we're basically able to draw cards so we basically juke two cards and discarded one so it's pretty much like in the lord of darkness but instead of uh banishing we just just discard but like i said with that play uh we're not able to go don drastic because like i said we're locked into zombies so then after that we'll probably have to go either into a zombie a necro dragon which we don't want to do or we'll just go into a sun so splendid saga which we kind of really don't want to do um but we also when the vendred link does come out we can definitely play that and we can sit on that because that card my god is that card so goddamn good shout out to my man Dwayne mcfred and he said i should play it i definitely would play it but like i said this was um like i told him this was built for tcg so when it comes out you know i'm able to actually play this exact deck Hopefully we get that as a, uh, a OCG import. That'd be very fucking lovely for the deck. And uh, yeah, I think that's about it for today. I don't know what I'm going to play tomorrow, but um, Thursday, I know for sure I'm going to be playing a Vendred deck and I'm going to build it like with Executor and stuff like that with rivalries so we can see where that goes. Because like I said, if your opponent can't target you, they're most likely, you know, if they can only target Executor and then like we have a rivalry and shit set, they're not able to really get over us. And then plus we're playing Trap Tricks. We're able to uh, get Swallow Slash, or I don't think I'm going to play Penalty Game in there because I think that's too many traps. I think we'll play three Rivalry, uh, three Trap Tricks, and two of this. Actually, that's really bad. No, we'll, we'll definitely probably play... 
I don't want to play 10 traps though. So did we just cut this to two or did we just bump this up to three? I think we just bumped this up to three because we can activate rivalry and then chain this. Because maybe we don't have to chain this. We just activate rivalry and then later in the turn just activate trap tricks. I think that will that's what we might do. We might just play nine um, and then keep that as this you know steady count. You really don't want to bog your deck down with traps and you also don't want to draw too many traps. But yeah. Um, that is it for today. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys did enjoy the video, like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. I will be back tomorrow. I don't know what I'm going to play yet. You guys can leave some suggestions down below. Uh, I might can take into consideration if I have enough time to, uh, what's the name, uh, to uh, like get a deck down and get some duels down. I'll definitely play that. But besides that, that is it. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy the video once again. And also, if you guys want to help the channel, I'll link to your description down below. And uh, you guys can click and add. And I'd appreciate any help and support I get. And I'll leave your comments and thoughts about this deck below. And I will see you guys next uh, tomorrow.